I'm Mike Copper, Adelphi University. I am the Northeast 10 Conference. I'm uh, from the Onondaga Reservation uh, outside of Syracuse, New York. Um, grew up there playing. Um, everybody plays lacrosse. My parents, they were away for school when I was born and uh, they decided to make the move back to Onondaga. My mother said to have us embrace and and understand where we come from and I think it helped out a lot with everything and as far as la lacrosse it's helped a lot because the community is so behind all the lacrosse players and everybody's so connected. I think Ike is, uh, yeah he brings something special to our team in that uh, the history and the roots of lacrosse you know, uh, he, he brings to our team, and I think there's a certain amount of respect that everybody has for Ike, uh, for what he does give to us. It was uh, great to, you know, meet Ike, especially at, when I was a freshman at OCC. That's uh, Onondaga Community College. He um, kind of like took me in under his wing a little bit. He actually took me down on the reservation a bunch of times, and, you know, I'm grateful that, you know, I was able to meet him, and uh, it's even better playing with him now, especially because, you know, the way we both play together, you know, it's, it's almost like we're brothers. You know, our thing is just to be chill because it's just what we do all the time. So it's just a way of life to play lacrosse. So, you know, you just take one play at a time and let things happen. We recruited him without knowing who Ike really is. And Ike is, may, may play chill, but he's one of the most passionate lacrosse players I've ever coached loves the game as much, if not more than anybody, and he's one of the smartest players that I've coached. Well, I would like to, yeah, I would like to finish up school, um, and then also it would, it would help to win a national championship as, as well, and I would like to go somewhere as warm, because I don't like the cold so much, so I was uh, looking into going somewhere as warm to continue my graphic design and get into maybe tattooing. I drew them all myself. It's all uh, traditional designs from Onondaga, and, um, I scaled them to fit, so any, anywhere I went to any artist, then it was already done and all they had to do was trace pretty much. We have that fire underneath us to, to want to succeed and we know what we need to get done and there's no stopping us this year. It's a real exciting time because these guys who didn't quite capture what we needed to last year have a chance to, to get a redo. One thing that people notice is that I don't really celebrate after a goal or anything because it's just, I'm used to it. I'll celebrate when we win the national championship, but until then, then you know, I'll stay cool and relaxed. <laughs>